Hello, Klaus here and welcome back to yet a, another video here at the channel. If you are a beginner in using Fusion, in this video I'm going to show you how you can do this typewriter effect, which has been used in a lot of different films and movies and whatnot. And you can actually do this pretty easy inside of Fusion. So without further ado, let's get right to the video. Let's go. Okay, so here we are in DaVinci Resolve and let's get started doing this effect pretty quickly. So first off, before we begin, we are going to take up a effect and we're going to add in a fusion composition. I already did that and I have that right down here. So I'm just going to select my composition and I'll go into fusion. And in fusion, I have this setup here, pretty simple. Just going to close the media pool. I have this setup, it's the background node going to the media out and I have merged in this text node. And this is a very simple effect to pull off. So we're going to go or select our text node and um, there's a couple of ways we can do this, but both of them just require that we go to the first keyframe, go into the inspector, and down here on write on, we are simply just going to remove everything and put in a keyframe. So the first way of doing it would be to go to a, let's say, to the end of our clip, and then go to the write on, and we're just going to push this all the way through. And now we have the uh, basic effect. And this might be what you want, but um, of course, if we want to do it a little bit different and we can actually control the words way better, we are going to kill the first keyframe we did. In fact, we're going to kill all of our keyframes like that. Go to last keyframe, kill that. Okay, go to the beginning. So if we want to make an effect like um, somebody is hesitating when they're writing, we can put in a keyframe, go a couple of frames, pause, and then we can just reveal one word. And we can then go, you know, a little more, reveal, and then like a little more, reveal. Maybe he's going to have a slightly pause here in a couple of frames before he, before he writes the rest of the word. And then we'll go a little further and comma and a little further and he goes me something like that so you can actually customize this this just the way you like so now we've done it a little bit different and then it is like this so that's basically how you do that effect you can then add in the keyboard effect underneath and you'll have a result like this If you want to use video or something moving underneath your typewriter text, you would have to make the background transparent and you'll do that by selecting your background and then going to the inspector and in the alpha channel and you're simply just going to push this all the way down. And with that done, you can go back to the edit page, add in some footage and you will have a result like this. So this is how you do a typewriter effect inside of Fusion, fast, quick, and easy. I do hope you found this video useful. If you did, please hit that subscribe button, give the video a like, share it with your friends if you think it would help them out. And if you want to be notified every time there's a new video on this channel, please hit that bell icon down in the corner. Until next time, keep filming, keep learning, and keep sharing. 